Um, I didn't give you a lot of info on the Enzo knife, the Enzo trapper actually when I was up there, so I thought I'd just do um, give you a little bit more info about it now and uh, show it to you just quickly again. Um, <clears throat> so the knife is um, eight and a quarter inches long altogether, and uh, it's a three and seven eighths inch blade, so 95 mil. And uh, I don't know, you see, I think it is there, yeah. It's uh, three and a half uh, mil thick, so it makes a nice slicer, but it's still strong enough to make a nice strong blade. So, like I say, very nice knife in the hand. Great all round uh, shape and size. It's a zero Scandi grind. So, a single bevel down at the edge. There. Makes a nice and easy uh, knife to sharpen. Holds a good edge as well. As you can see, it hasn't had tons of use yet on this one. So, uh, I'm going to um, do a bit more of an in depth review on the knife when, um, when I've had it a bit longer and um, I've done a bit more work on it. But I'm very pleased with them so far. I knew they'd be a good knife actually. You, you know, when you when you see a knife like that, um, you know, you can just tell it's going to be a good knife just by the shape and its lines, and, and it has been. So I've been really pleased with that. And um, I'll put some more info on the site. And uh, you can always email me, Paul at WorkwearCanada.com. And uh, if you need any more info on the knife, um, and we have a few others, the Badgers, and we have the D2 uh, flat grinds, Scandi grinds, zero Scandi, and they do a D2 with a a uh, Scandi grind with a, a secondary bevel on it as well, so we'll have those in stock at some point as well. So anyway, yeah, give me an email, paul at workwithcanada.com if you need any more info on the uh, Enzo Trapper. Okay, thanks.